Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another quick pick prediction video. In this video, I'll be predicting the featherweight bout on the contender series between Alex Morgan versus Blake Bowder or Bowder, Bio, Builder. I'm gonna say Builder, I'm saying Bowder. This man is spitting bow. But um, I'm gonna say Builder. Correct me if I'm wrong, but Builder, B I L D E R. So Alex Morgan versus Blake Builder. Featherweight division, contender series, high season one right here. I'm going average confidence. Blake Builder. Alex Morgan does look like the more complete fighter to me. Maybe we'll, I don't know. I'm, just, I don't, I'm not even going to get into all that. Who I see going to have in the best future. I'm not really high on either guy, to be honest, from what I've seen. But what I do see is I feel like Morgan is, has created a track record of he does not do the best against grapplers. And, and um, Builder is a pretty solid grappler, you know, pretty good submission skills. Not oh, pretty decent on the feet as well. Definitely, I said Morgan like he has more power on the feet, more composure on the feet. Look, he looks more comfortable on the feet than Builder does. You know, raw. Well, I mean, some grapplers but he's not the best. But anyway, I'm just looking at his record. A guy that has struggles with submission grapplers for the most part. It seems you know he started as a grappler, so struggles, struggles. You know, his biggest struggles with uh, his biggest struggles I've seen have come via submission. That's his most common way of losing. Then you got other guy in Builder, his most common way of winning is uh, submission. So. If the guy like well, I'm trying to predict this based off who has um the more proven path to victory or who has that more proven path to victory and that proven more proven path is um Blake Builder because Morgan has a history of getting submitted. Builder is confident enough and skilled enough to you know be able to put him in those similar situations and I feel like he's gonna be able to put him in a situation where he's gonna be tapped out. Better to fight nonetheless, but I just have to like um what well, I have like I like the fact that stylistically Builder has something that has been causing Morgan issues or in the grappling area. Whether he worked on it or not, I gotta go historics and the historics have me leaning towards Blake Builder here. So I'm gonna feel like second round submission. First round probably gonna be Morgan look pretty good. And um but once Builder starts to fight starts to slow down a little bit, settle down a little bit, Builder's gonna be able to get his takedowns and you know get stab some control time. You know, really be to set up his submission games, you know, work with the ground and pound, then be able to find that submission or create an opening, create a mistake and um Morgan capitalize, tap him out second round. So in this fight, I got Blake Builder via second round submission. 